Hello, I am Rupendra Kumar. I am going to perform a experiment of study, understand and perform experiments on timers and counters under industrial automation laboratory. Let us open this experiment. In this experiment, we will understand the operation of timers and counters. Here are two types of counter, on delay timer and off delay timer and also a timer, retentive timer. Let us move into simulator to perform. Before this, we need to understand the procedure to perform this experiment. In the part 1 of this experiment, we will understand the operation of delay timer and of time of delay timer and in the part 2 of this experiment, we will understand the operation of up and down counter by following this procedure. Let us move to simulator and open the procedure side by side. According to procedure part 1, now we are going to understand on delay and off delay timer operation. For this, we need a digital input block a on delay timer T on and a digital output now just connect the output of digital input to the input of on delay timer and output of on delay timer to the input of digital output now this on delay timer will provide a delay in operation edge set in the preset value. Let me set 6000 milliseconds means 6 seconds delay for a operation. Let us compile this program. Run. Let us see what happens if I toggle the digital input. I have toggled the digital input and the timing operation is in progress and as the timer is accumulator is reached the preset value we are getting output in digital output. So we got a delay of 6 seconds before getting output in digital output. By this we have understood the operation of on delay timer. Let us stop this program and move to the under, move to understand the operation of off delay timer. For that we need to delete this on delay timer block and drag off delay timer at the place of it. Now just connect the output of digital input to the input of off delay timer and output of off delay timer to the input of digital output. Now this off delay timer will provide a delay to switch on the operation as the preset value provided. Let me provide a delay of 7000 milliseconds means 7 seconds to switch off the operation. Let us compile this program and run. As I toggle the digital input, I am getting the output but we should get a delay of 7 seconds by getting 
getting by switching off this operation now uh, my digital input is 0 and we got digital output 0 by a by a when accumulator value reached the preset value means after the 7 seconds of delay by this we have understood the operation of off delay timer let us stop this program and move further to the counter operations for this we just need to delete this block and drag up counter at the place of it and a reset button also for this just connect the output of digital input to the input of up counter and output of up counter to the input of digital output Now we have to configure the up counter. I am naming the up counter as CU and I am giving it a preset value of 5. Now for to reset the up counter I I need to configure the reset according to our counter. There is no need to reset, so I am deleting it. Now, let us compile this program and see what happens if I toggle the input. As we can see, for first transition, accumulator value is incremented by 1. And for every transi every transition value is incrementing by one. Now, as the accumulator value is reached preset value, we have got the output. By this, we have understood the operation of up counter. Let us stop this program and delete up counter and drag down counter to understand the operation of down counter and connect the terminals as previous now let us give it a preset value and configure it I have given the preset value 6. Let us compile this program and run. Now we can see accumulator value is already 6. Now for every transition this value accumulator value should decrease by 1 and let us see what happened by toggle. As we can see for every transition in digital input down counter accumulator value is decrementing by 1 and output is, is still 1 now we can see as the accumulator value is reached 0 our output is 0 by this operation we have understood the application of down counter by this we have performed 
all the programs that we were need we were required to perform in this experiment thank you